1950, a game show began on TV that ran for many, many years called Truth or Consequences. In the game, contestants were asked a series of questions. If they answered correctly, they were rewarded. If they answered incorrectly, they suffered the consequences, which were usually very funny. Life is very much like that. We make the choices, but we cannot choose the consequences. Proverbs gives us many instances of this cause and effect relationship. In fact, the entire Bible does so. It uses the word therefore 1,220 times. Therefore means because of, because of this, then this, therefore this. Life is a series of choices and each one produces results, good or bad. For instance, in Proverbs chapter 10 verse 4, the Bible said, He becometh poor that dealeth with a slack hand, but the hand of the diligent maketh rich. Slack hand, poverty. Uh, diligence tends to riches. Proverbs chapter 10 and verse 12, Hatred stirreth up strifes, but love covereth all sins. You sow hatred, you'll reap strife. You sow love and uh, you'll, you'll reap love in return. Verse 27, the fear of the Lord prolongeth days, but the years of the wicked shall be shortened. I've lived long enough to see this come true in practice in the lives of many people. You live for the Lord, live wisely according to scripture, it'll tend toward long life. You disobey God's commandments, it'll tend toward death. We choose our path, but we cannot choose the consequences.